original last name is Long, but you decided to add Mitru to it. Can you elaborate on that? Yeah, um, you know, actually my, my full last name is Mitru Long, um, but I have a really long name, Nazareth Mitru Long. Um, so in college, you know, the Naz Long kind of motto just stuck onto the fans and just kept it simple. I mean, it's a lot easier to write on tests and stuff like that during college, so I just kept it solid. But my uh, last year, I thought, to go out, you know, I, I want to be known and, and remembered for who I am fully. Um, and I feel like representing your name, especially your last name is a big part of that. So putting that full last name on, on the back of my jersey was very important to myself as well as, you know, my mother and, and that side of the family. Um, you can say that you have few national identities, uh, Greek, Canadian and Trinidadian and Tob Tobagonian. How important is every, every one of these parts of nationality to you? It's very important. Um, it represents where I come from in regards to being raised in Canada. Um, you know, there's a bunch of different diversities and it, it stands a lot for what I believe in in regards to nobody should be treated different just because of, you know, where they're from. You should be treating everybody the same. We're all, you know, souls at the end of the day and that's what I believe in. So. Um, I think it's a very important part of understanding who I am and, uh, you know, representing who I am. What about the Greek part? Do you, do you visit Greece uh, during summer? Yeah, so I've, I've been to Greek, uh, Greece twice. Um, you know, I was able to go up and visit the Acropolis, walk around, have some of the food, you know, uh, just, just tap in with my roots a little bit. I definitely need to do a little bit more. Um, you know, my brother plays out there, so we talk a lot about how the, the culture is, you know, how the water is. My mother loves it out there. She's truly her full self when she's there. Um, so definitely an important tie and, and respect for, for, you know, my Greek side. You played with uh, Domantas Sabonis in Pacers. Uh, did you have a chance to chat with him about playing in here? Yeah, he was, uh, when the deal got done, um, he was one of the first people to reach out to me, just basically wishing me good luck, letting me know that he's going to be supporting me all year. Um, you know, I'm, Domas is one of my favorite players. He's a one-on-one -one player. Nobody in the league really plays like him as far as physicality goes, and I think you can see a true Lithuanian in the way he plays, you know, very strong, very, uh, you know, physical forward. And um, he's always been a good friend of me. Um, I've always been a supporter and friend of his. So, you know, it's, it's a mutual respect. Last year, after the game in Jalgiro Arena with uh, Olympia Milano, uh, your coach, uh, th then coach Ettore Messina, told the media that uh, he's glad about your performance. Right now, you are a member of Jalgiro. Isn't it interesting of how things came full circle? Yeah, um, again, big believer in, you know, the universe being connected, the circle of life. And, um, you know, Zalgaris is a team that's been on my radar and, and you know, I've been on their radar for quite some time now. Um, so I, I don't think it's any coincidence that I'm here. I think it's uh, very interesting to see how things come full circle. And when we got done the game here last year, um, I said to my teammates, this was by far the, the, the most favorite gym that I had um, to that point and then even past that point. So I'm very happy to be here and wearing this jersey. What about compared to the NBA gyms that you've been in? It's up there with that. Um, you know, obviously you could say the capacity in the NBA gyms are a little bit bigger, but as far as quality goes, it being plush, it being clean. I mean, the support from the fans, the dim lights in the crowd, the court, the rims. I mean, it's there's really no difference. You know what I'm saying? And I get that vibe being in here and. I've always wanted to play on the biggest stage and in the biggest gyms and arenas, and I would definitely consider this to be one, if not the best in Europe.